Hey guys, it's the Magic Crafter. I'm going to be unboxing a package from Myriad Studios that they sent to me. I did not pay for this one, full disclaimer. This is a sponsored video because I am actually considering becoming an ambassador for this company. So I'm kind of testing the waters there, but I have a couple of tails here and a couple of tops and I'm going to open this box up and show you what's inside because who doesn't love new mermaid tails? And now that I have a Mahina monofin, I can put the tails on in a try-on video without them looking super baggy and awkward in the fluke. <laughs> if you don't know about Nereid Studios, I do have another video on my channel about this company. They make neoprene tails that are beautiful and affordable for mer people of all types. And uh, I already own one. It's a winter mirage one. It's very pretty and I will be getting some more pictures and videos of that this summer, so stay tuned. And now I have a couple more to add to the family. I have my handy dandy dagger here that is not sharp, but it does cut. So, open this up. Ah! We're just going to beast mode it. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> and even though I am in the woods, all this stuff is going to be recycled or thrown away, depending on when we get home. I don't leave trash out in the woods, in case anyone's wondering. Oh. Oh. Okay. So this actually is quite heavy. Oops, we're just that right here. Just kind of like stab. Okay. <laughs> it's actually quite heavy because there's a couple of tails in here. So here's the box. The Nereid Studios logo on it. Very fancy. And oh, she actually has a crown on there similar to the one I'm wearing. I don't know if you can see that or not. So we're gonna open this up. And I'm gonna show you what's inside. As you can see, there are a couple of different colors. Now this does not mean that I am creating a new character based off of these colors. Just consider this as Mermaid Phantom doing what Phantom does best and transforming in whatever way she sees fit. So just like we have fairy videos and mermaid videos with different tales, these are just new tales for Phantom. This is not the new character, just so y'all know. So the first thing I'm going to show you are these tops that I have. I got a size small because I have itty bitty titties. Ooh, they are heavy. Holy cow. Just down for a second. So this is the red top that I got. And this is a small, but wow. That actually looks, oh, which way does it go? It's a size A, but it looks massive. At least for my, my ladies, it's gonna be kind of big. But this is a, a red one. It's a nice red print. I've never had, oh, I think it goes this way. <laughs> there we go. I've never had a mermaid scale top before. I know these are printed neoprene scales with like a padded inside, but I mean, I've never had a mermaid bra that I haven't made. So there's that and it's kind of cool. I'm excited to try them on and hopefully they'll fit and I'll look decent and not fall apart when I'm wearing them because my boobs never like to stay put. And this is the second one here. It's gonna give you a hint at what the tails will look like. Ooh, it's got little stars on it. Okay, so this is the purple one. These are really heavy for bras, by the way. They're, they just feel heavy to me. I guess I never really wear bras unless they're shell bras. So maybe I've just forgotten what they feel like, but they feel really heavy, which is good because you're not going to like nip out to be informal. And now onto the tails, the part I know you guys have been waiting for. If you guys like Seeing these Nereid Studios tails, let me know because there is a possibility to have more of these coming in in the future so you can see more of them. But I don't want to do anything you guys don't like want to see here because this channel, well, it is my channel, is also your channel. So let me know what you think. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you the red one first. So this is the autumn foliage tail. Woo! Okay. The, it's, oh, I like this. If you know me, you know that while I love winter, fall is my favorite season. I love fall so much. This tail, wow, okay. Uh, this, huh. it's got really pretty oranges and reds. This is like a pinkish red up here. And then down here, it has like some blackish brown with some little red tips on some of the scales. It's got beautiful, beautiful fins that remind me of a maple leaf which is perfect because we're here in the woods and we have like this beautiful tree over here behind us. So it has that. It doesn't have a dorsal, but it does have those beautiful leaves or fins. <laughs> and here is the, 
the quite large fluke. And it has red clips that snap in place. I'm not a huge fan of the snaps, but it does keep the tail closed, which is nice. Oh, it's got some pink streaks too. I really like this one. The, even though I don't like pink, the pink streaks kind of remind me of like when you have the sun going through a leaf on a fall day and it kind of has like that glow. It kind of reminds me of that glow and I think it's really pretty. I'll zoom in and show you the tail in full in a second. I'm hesitant to show you them here though because there's just so much debris on the ground and we are going to, put, to film at the beach but we just decided to go here so here we are. The next one I have is the Dawnbreaker by Myriad Studios. These are both neoprene by the way and uh, I didn't mention this before but I'm going to mention it right now. I did decide to go with a size small for these because the last one I got was a size medium and it was a bit too big in certain areas. So hopefully these will fit okay. I'm gonna try them on in a little bit here. So this is the one, I don't know why, I'm super excited about this one because it reminds me of a certain purple dragon from a certain video game. And that's actually what my makeup is inspired by today. The little horns and everything too. We have the Dawnbreaker tail. Oh, It's got very narrow fins on the side. Got two fins, very narrow and floppy. It's got nice purples and orangey yellows. It's got little stars on it. I just love this one. It was actually the one I was debating getting instead of the Mirage, the Winter Mirage one. So that I get to own both of them makes me super happy. <laughs> and they're both really pretty. Again, this one reminds me of a certain dragon. If you know who I'm talking about, please comment below. If you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm sorry your childhood wasn't that fun. Wait, what? <laughs> so here's this one. I'm gonna zoom in and show you this one as well. Gosh, these, these are pretty. I feel very spoiled <laughs> to have these and wow, okay. Um, New Read Studios, thank you for sending these tales. To you guys watching this, please let me know which one you like best and let me know which one you wanna see me swim in first. The Winter Mirage, which you can see that video down in the description box, the Dawnbreaker or the Autumn Foliage Tail. And if you'd like to get your own, please click the description box to get a Nereid Studios tail of your own. They're very affordable and they are very thick. It's like a neoprene fabric, it's thick. And they are quite nice. Very ideal for the traveling mermaid or the mermaid who doesn't want to carry around a 30 pound silicone tail. So, thank you for watching. I'll see you next week with a try on video of the tail of your choice. Thanks for watching.